In this video, you'll see how to use the MemberPress Divi add-on to protect individual elements on pages with the Divi Page Builder. Here, I have a sample MemberPress site set up on WordPress. I also have the Divi Page Builder installed. So, to get started, I'm going to go to MemberPress and Add-ons. I'll find the Divi add-on, then I'll click Install. Once that's done, I'll go to Pages here in the left sidebar and click to edit a sample page I created earlier. So for this video, I'm going to keep things simple and show you a basic example. Let's say that I want this first text block to be visible to everyone, meaning anyone who visits my site, regardless of if they're a member or logged in or not. And the second text block, I want to only be visible to those who have my pro membership and are logged in. So first, I'll go to Member Press and Rules to set up a rule to restrict this content with. I'll click Add New. And then with this drop down, I'll come down here to Partial. Then I'll set this to Membership and Pro. Then I'll save the rule. Now, going back to my page, I'll click the text block here and come to the Member Press tab. Under Protect Content, I'll select the partial role that I just created. And here, I'll set to Use My Default Unauthorized Message, which is set up in my Member Press settings. Now, I'll click the check mark. And then I'll come down here and click to save the page. Now I'll copy this page's URL. And then I'll open a new incognito window in Google Chrome, so I'm not logged in as my site's admin user. I'll go to the page and see that I can see the first text block here. And instead of the second one, I see the unauthorized message. Now, I just protected some text to keep this video simple, but you can use this to protect pretty much anything here in the Divi Builder on your page, like videos, images, forms, and more. Now, I'll exit this incognito window to show you a few other options with the Divi add-on. I'll go back to my page and click that text block I protected. And going back to the Member Press tab, here under Unauthorized Content, I can choose to hide this text block altogether. So in my case, if someone isn't logged in or doesn't have a pro membership on my site, it'll hide the text and it won't show it at all. And you can also select display message to show a custom message instead of the unauthorized message set up in your member press settings. So just to show you real quick, I'll enter a custom message here. Then I'll make sure I save the page. Now I'll go back to my page in a new incognito window again and I can see the custom message here. Now, I'll log in with a test user that I have set up on my site that has a pro membership. And once I'm logged in, I'll go back to my sample page. And now I can see the protected text since the user has a pro membership. You've now seen an overview of how to use the MemberPress Divi add-on to protect elements on pages with MemberPress. Thanks for watching. If you liked the video, be sure to like, subscribe, and check out our other videos that makes getting MemberPress up and running a breeze.